Hey everyone, it's Jenny with Silver Sneakers. I love using the ball within the classes that I teach. It's a fun piece of equipment that offers great opportunities for hand-eye coordination. It's also a great way to work those fingers, wrists, and hands. Here's a fun tip or a fun opportunity that I like to use within my class that not only works with finger strength, but also offers a little cognitive challenge. We start out first with just numbering our fingers. So one is your index finger, two middle fingers, three ring fingers, four are pinkies, and then I just have them tell them that the thumbs are used for remote control changing. Um, you could try this with 16 counts of your music to start. So you'll start out slowly and we'll just go one, two, three, four with our fingers. It would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and four times you'll press your thumbs against the ball. So let's try it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then four thumbs. Breaking that to eight counts will be a little faster. So it's one, two, three, four, and two thumbs. Try it. One, two, three, four, and two thumbs again. One, two, three, four, and two thumbs. As they get used to the idea, I now add that cognitive piece. So maybe the first time you say two, two, four, one. Two, two, four, one, thumbs. Try it. Two, two, four, one, thumbs. I may even call it so it's middle, middle, pinky, index, thumbs. You get the idea. As they continue to get a little stronger, we can go a little bit faster, but I like to, in order for them to feel success, I wanna make sure that it's something that they can handle. So check this out. The last time I go through, I give them something really easy. All ones, try it. One, 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 thumbs. I think they'll feel success with that. Good luck with your classes and we'll see you next time.